I'll raise. Oh, that's crazy. I'll call your bluff. Huzzah! <coughs> Hello there, everybody. Anyone up for a rousing game of poker? Welcome back to the month of the fool. Today on the menu is, of course, Poker Night 2. I've heard some interesting things about this game. Mostly that it has a lot of funny stuff in it, believe it or not. Yeah, I know, a poker game having a lot of funny stuff in it. It's got a lot of cameo appearances, to say the least. Heck, you can tell just by the... Good luck, human. You can tell just by the chauffeur that it's going to be an interesting and wild ride. Poker Night at the Inventory. Well, the sequel to that. Thanks, Dr. Sayus. I know that's a little delayed, but... It just now crossed my head. Everything looks normal so far. Well, about as normal as it can be. Good game. Let's do it again sometime. And this is one of the contestants. Brock, the Venture Brothers. Oh, hey, it's you. What's up? All right. Come on, I'll lead you in. My name's Samson. Brock Samson. I'm familiar with you. Friggin' place is like a maze. Ah, Mr. Samson. I lost track of you for a moment. And you've brought the player! Splendid! On behalf of everyone at the inventory, I cannot begin to express our unbridled elation to see you return for another night of high-stakes poker. Yeah. Uh, speaking of high stakes, things may have gotten stabby over in the mumbly peg room. Mr. Samson, I once again remind you that the inventory is not your personal yeah, yeah, send the cleaning bill to Venture Industries. Mm, that's what you said the last time. Huh. <laughs> ah. As always, I am Commodore Reginald Van Winslow, retired. And I will hey, be your host cheeks. for tonight's perilous on voyage smokes. on the seas of chance. <laughs> Thanks, Pat. And it's Sam hey, Reggie, from... these new chairs are great. It's like my keister is being held aloft by the wings of tiny velvet angels. Sam and Max. Try, Sam. I'm afraid there's no room at the table for your plus one, Sam. That's okay. Max will make his own fun. Come out with your arms akimbo, Mendoza! So when do we get this clam back on the road? In a few minutes. We're still waiting for... Hello! Hello, future losers! Our remaining contestants. Claptrap. Seriously, whose HDMI port do I have to kiss to get a drink around here? From the Borderlands. She would know him. Ooh, I really love what you've done with the place. Very, uh, Boardwalk Empire meets Silence of the Lambs. As I was saying, you're Can we get going? Steve and I have a tea time at Spyglass. Uh, I suppose we should. I'd hoped our final contestant would be here by now. But it appears that we'll be one short tonight. Thou art Ash. Hail to the king, baby. What an entrance. Deal me in. Even Brock's shocked. Army of Darkness. Tonight's tournaments have a $20,000 buy-in. Everything seems to be in order. The chips are stacked. The deck is shuffled. Let the tournament begin! Gentlemen, I leave you to the tender mercies of GLaDOS. Good evening. Great. What the hell, Wayne? Hubba, hubba! This completes the first test of the contestants' poker faces. The bad news is you all failed miserably. The good news is, you appear to be evenly matched. As if things weren't crazy enough already. The name of the game is Texas Hold'em. Very well, in poker, players create hands of five cards. Poker is played for money, goods, services, and bragging rights. It's also an excuse to hang out with friends and chew the fat. 
Texas Hold'em players are dealt two cards and make hands using five community cards dealt face up in the center of the table. Texas Hold'em was created when the El Paso Dealers Union complained of wrist strain when dealing a full five card hand. After a lengthy strike by the insufferable louts, this stately variation was born. In Texas Hold'em, you may use your best five cards out of seven to create your hand. The two players to the left of the dealer pass the blinds, small antes that all players must match to stay in the hand. They post the blinds. The two cards dealt face down to you are the basis of your hand. They are known as your whole cards. Playing with high pairs, high cards of the same suit, or cards in a sequence is prudent play, although technically any two cards have a chance of winning. Now it's time to bet your hand. If you haven't posted the blind, you can choose to match the blind or raise the bet. There's no limit to the amount you can bet. During any betting round, you can bet all of your chips and go all in, a move that ideally should be accompanied by a steely gaze and bone-dry armpit, armpits. Once you've gone all in, you may see percentages floating above the table, reflecting your current probability of winning the hand. Of trying, which is why some probabilities add up to more than 100%. After a round of betting, the first three community cards are placed face up in the center of the table. These cards are called the flop due to their magical ability to make less experienced players flop around like a fish out of water. After the flop, you may notice players acting strangely. Chin scratching, finger tapping, projectile vomiting, subtle actions like these are tells that the clever player can use to divine the strength of an opponent's hand. Another round of betting occurs after the flop. If you've made your hand on the flop, you might want to consider throwing out a few more chips to reel in your fish. A fourth card is added to the community cards. This card is called the turn because it's at this point that many people, players see their hopes and dreams turn into dust, ashes, or cow patties. Another round of betting occurs after this turn. If everyone's still in the pot after the turn, someone's probably bluffing. After the third round of betting, the final card is added to the community cards. This card is called the river. Harkening back to a bygone era when gamblers were regularly hurled from riverboats. Players who ask for a six community card will be slapped with wet bar towel. After the river card is dealt, the final round of betting occurs. If you're in over your head on the river, you might want to swim for sure. When all betting is finished, all players have gone all in. Each player must show his or her, his or her cards and a winner is determined. Don't build little castles with your chips. It makes you look like a rookie. Let's do it. I don't know what I'm doing. Not the best starting oh. hand. Eh, I'll call. There I go. I am so into these cards. Check. <laughs> That's fascinating. Ooh, a seven. Checking. Okay, I'll bet. I'll call. I call. Nah. Hmm. I'll check. Wow, not much to go here. I fold. Ooh, a fold. Snaky. I'm not sure whether this hand's getting interesting or stupid. Check. I this hand. I should have paid more attention. In Ooh. Before. Two pairs. Not bad. <laughs> Although. I buy a lot of Bowie knives. Ah, oh, damn it, Allen. Who the what now? Nope. Brock must be very confident. Brock steals the pot. Yeah, that was probably the right call. Click anywhere to deal next hand. Eh, not very good. I'll call. Not that I'm complaining, but is it always so quiet in here? The inventory has seen a 23% decline in customers since I was installed as the dealer. I can't imagine why, what with your sunny personality and all. This I have seems... several competing hypotheses for this phenomena, but the most likely one is that the fleeing customers were intimidated by my intelligence. Or maybe they died. That happens a lot when I'm around. This is the real. How much I love it when you scare the humans. This is the real draw of the game. Just their silliness. Trying to read my face for tells, huh? Well, good luck with that. I've taken so many blows to the head that the muscles in my face twitch for no damn reason at all. <laughs> that's that's great. That's lovely. I'm gonna call. Oh. Meh. 
So Ash is the only one left, huh? All in. Ah, oh, nuggets. Ouch. Now that is ballsy. You Let's should see know that a Williams never bluffs. Except when we do. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say. You sure about that? I'll call your bluff. Ha! <laughs> Who's your daddy? The player has a pair of tens, and Mr. Williams has three of a kind. Ouch! You probably should have gotten out of that hand. Mr. Williams wins the pot. Come to so he, daddy. He wasn't bluffing. Man, he's good. Two pretty good cards. But... Call. Unless they actually stack with something else, it's worthless. I'm blind. I fall. I'll call. Whoa! Really? <laughs> wow. I don't know. I'm in. No more cards. About to say, ooh, two queens. That's pretty good. Let's see if I can beat them or not. I'll keep this friendly. I'm in. Well, this is all my. These are all my chips, so I can't really do anything else. Check. Check. I'm still all in. I'm probably gonna oh, lose. Check. <laughs> Bet. I scrape bigger bets than that out of my tire treads. Ouch. Brock has a pair of fours. I have a pair of queens. Ash has ace high, and you have a pair of queens. On the side pot, Brock wins the hand. And on the main pot, the player wins. Oh yeah! I'm not out of this yet! What the hell was that? What was that? Did you just try to hypnotize us with subliminals? Maybe. Are you upset? Upset? <laughs> I think I'm in love. Excuse me? Listen, you're a robot, and I'm a robot. You like screwing around with people, and I like screwing around in general. So why don't we just go out for some pasta, a couple of bottles of Merlot, and a little conversation? Are you flirting with me? Let me check my variables. Yep. The flirting flag is set to true. Enjoy. Wait, what? Oh, I was about to say. She actually... Kind of drifted off there. Did she actually make it... Did she actually make the window non-primary? Because for some reason... I'm gonna call. It's only 400. That's right. Think, think, think. Ah, I'm in. My hand is nope. terrible. I'm gonna fold. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. Yeah. Brock steals the pot. Fear's a bitch, Ed. Way to go, Brock. Seems killing isn't the only thing you specialize in. Eh. Nah. -uh. I think I'll call. I don't know, guys. My my hand sucks, but I think I'm gonna call anyway. I call. Ache, loser's leg. <laughs> hmm. Check. Interesting. Check. Very interesting. Checko. Yeah, I'll check. I don't know. I, uh... I'll bet. 
I think I'll call your bet. Not this time. Just remember, it's only a game. Call? Yeah, I'll call your bluff. Ooh, impressive. Uh, check. I do have an ace up my sleeve. All the heck in. Who the what now? He's serious. Alright, I'll call your bluff. I may as well go all in, too. <laughs> Stop taunting the chicken, Max. Whoa, <laughs> oh, nice. Woo, nice. Well, I'm probably gonna lose, I but... We'll see. <laughs> Rock Samson has a pair of tools. The player has ace high. Sam has a flush. On the side part, Sam wins. And on the main part, Sam takes the pot. Damn. Well, I lost. Come to Papa, little chick. But it was nice while it lasted. the money, Max. I mean, Sam. The player has been eliminated due to lack of funds and intelligence. Thanks. I know you can't tell because my groupers don't really bend that way, but I'm making the international symbol for loser on the part of my body that closely approximates a human forehead. Or maybe it's for glee. Either way, it's super humiliating. That's lovely. Anyway. Let's go ahead and try that again. Unlocks. Let's see what we got. You don't have enough tokens to purchase this item. Oh, I don't have any tokens at all. Fair enough. Now, how do I get back into it? Welcome back, poker enthusiast. While you were away, our engineers completed construction of the inventory's brand new Bounty Challenge Randomizer. Really? Splendid. Now the onus is on you. Simply complete these three simple tasks, and an opportunity to compete for a magnificent treasure will avail itself. As always, the tournament buy-in is $20,000. Yep. Yeah, I got a jack. Not bad. I call. Hold on. I raise. I'm gonna call. Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. I call. Oh, yeah, I guess I wasn't allowed to yet. I'll call. Hmm. Oh. I'm out. Those two are very confident in themselves. Two kings. Huh. What do you know? Check. 11% of all poker moves are checks. That's not an interesting statistic. But neither was your check. Yeah, I'll bet. Not that I've been staring uncomfortably at your rock hard abs or anything, but you guys seem pretty fit. I'm gonna call. With this. How do you Maybe I can wait. Mostly by running and screaming. Swinging around a chainsaw is also great for the lats. Maybe I can freak them out a little. I, I'm more of an isometrics kind of guy. Twisting necks until they splinter takes a great load of dynamic tension. What do you say we make this more interesting? Kind of stuff all the time. But my belly still is jiggly and off-putting as a Three's Company reunion special. It could be your diet. An analysis of your saliva indicates that your internal organs are almost entirely comprised of cellophane resiny byproducts, mass-produced sponge-like desserts, and an impenetrable substance known only as fudgy freezes. <laughs> Wait a minute. Those things are bad for me? Initially, yes. Now the preservatives are the only thing keeping you alive. Of course, they're also responsible for your girth. It's a bit of a catch-22. Huh. I love those. I'm gonna raise. Ah, no mercy. Damn right. Hold. I think I'll call. You sure about that? <laughs> you sure you can afford to? Let's see. Bet. Let's go ahead and bet. Spicy. Fudge. All in. Man, he's not playing he's around. Impressive. All in. Impressive. Ah, really? Hell. Great day in the morning. Oh, I'm gonna lose. 
Yes. No, I mean yes. Sam has two pair, and our silent friend has two pair. Sam wins with the higher pairs. Oh, that's great. Never bet against a freelance policeman on the edge of his seat. Ah, uh, that was the great. The player has been eliminated. Oh, and here I was just starting to contain my nausea at your hideous visage. Gee, thanks. Let's Back try it again. Another round of high stakes excitement, eh? Splendid! And Clearly. just in time for a momentous announcement as well. You finally replaced the urinal cakes. Yes, and we've renewed our liquor license. Wonderful. Who's thirsty? All right. Drinks are five I tokens may each. Be with the inventory tokens you've acquired. Be warned that the inventory will not be held responsible for the deleterious effects that alcoholic spirits may have on your gameplay. Dumb Indeed. What? And with that disclaimer out of the way, on with the tournament. I In other words, that everyone has brought the requisite twenty thousand dollar buy-in for tonight's tournament. You're Didn't paying. The buy-in used to be ten thousand dollars. It was, but the owner theorized that upping the stakes would bring in a better class of competitors. Okay, that explains how you snagged a bunch of multimedia megastars like yours truly. But what about Captain Lamo over there? It's only a theory. Gentlemen and Claptrap. In other words, you're paying to inebriate them. Let's see about this. Hey, you want a drink? I'll call. Not this time. And I'm out. Yeah, I'll call. Chico Rema. Fascinating. <laughs> What's so oh. funny? Sorry, sorry. Inside joke. You had to be there. Check. Check. I raise by a thousand. Uh, call. I call. I get the feeling this bluffing isn't working. Hmm. Check. I'll check. Let's check. I'll check that. I'll check. Check. The player has ace high. Mr. Williams has ace high. Sam has ace high. Ash wins with a queen picker. Boom. And well done, Ash. How about I buy you a drink? How do I do that again? What? Do I have a booger on my nose? I'm just trying to figure out where your gas cap is. Gas cap? Good sir! I am offended! All Claptrap units run on an advanced form of fusion. One that is both carbon neutral and remarkably affordable to the average consumer. If you're running on fusion, then why am I smelling diesel fumes? Oh, that! That's my aftershave! Nothing drives the lady robots crazy like a few dabs of burning hydrocarbons behind the audio sensors. Oh yeah! Whatever you say, buddy. It's driving me insane. Just like Lizzie Borden. Yeah, it's driving her insane. She wants to kill you. Bet. Not bad. Not really good, but not bad. Nope. I call. Call? I get the feeling I'm not doing this properly. You know what? I think I'm gonna... F yeah, check. I'll bet. I think checking is free. I fold. Hmm. Yeah, I may as well fold too. My hand sucks. Ash grabs the pot. Someone get a hose, cause I'm on fire, baby. Does he really have to use his gun for that? Well, I guess why not, right? <laughs> Ooh. Oh, my hand sucks, guys. Oh, great. 
More sucky hole cards. I know, right? Call. I fall. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, guys. My hand kind of sucks. But just to make this interesting. Ooh, impressive. I'm out. Yeah, I'm in. You sure about that? Hold on. I gotta finish my tweet. The tweet in the tournament. Tweeting, live blogging, thought spamming, hashtag clap trap kicks butt in the hizz out. That's screw it all in. Really? Oh, impressive. All right. Who wants some? <laughs> I'm gonna lose. Never bring a knife to a chainsaw fight. Kids. Well. <laughs> yeah, he won. Cool. Exciting. I'm terrible at poker. Did I mention that? That's the stuff. The player has a pair of fives, and Ash has a flush. Ash wins the hand. Yeah, I lost. Rude. There's no sense in playing this out. Wait, what the hell? Oh, okay. Yeah, I lost. The player has busted out and must leave the table before everyone starts laughing. Too late. Better luck next time, kid. Let's try one more time. Maybe I'll eventually win one. If you'll all be so kind as to empty up. Good thing I've got an infinite amount of money, apparently. It's a mathematical certainty that 80% of you are going to lose tonight. And 100% of you will eventually die. Math is fun, don't you think? And there's a 100% chance that everyone here, GLaDOS included, will eventually decay. Call. I call. I fold. Yeah, screw this, I'm folding. Check. I'll check. Check. Hmm, what would Chuck Finley do? I'll bet. Nah. I'll fold. Looks like Ash won the pot. Ash grabs the pot. Like taking candy from a baby. That guy, huh? Eight and six. I don't want a prize. What kind of baddies are they offering at that smart these days? Oh, we're unionized at the yin yang, Brocco. Low deductible medical, full dental and vision, matching 401k, and a generous life insurance policy. Which is nice considering all the deadites. What about you? That's ah, pretty much the same in the OSI, except for the life insurance on account of, uh, well, you know, mortality, right? How about you, Sam? Uh, well, every Christmas the commissioner gives us a floaty pen from a different state. I think we're up to Missouri now. Oh, that sucks. What about you, Claptrap? I'm gonna call. Sure, why not? Check. Not exactly a good starting hand. Ouch. Check. Man. I check. Check. Luckily, checking is free. Uh, check. Check. I'll raise. Oh, that's crazy. I'll call your bluff. Pretty ballsy move for a gelding. <laughs> Call. Time to lose. Fold. Hmm. Check. Wow. Check. Yeah, this is bad. I'm folding. Don't feel bad. If I had your brain, I'd fold too. Of course you would. Mr. Samson has a pair of sevens. 
and Mr. Williams has King High. Mr. Samson wins the pot. Huh, cool. Samson won one. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to end this here. And just when I was going so well. That's gonna have to be it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around Bye. like funny banters. Luckily, that's the real draw of the game, and I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Whoa, Time every really? single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon, or just check out the end screens right here. I call. Okay, Claptrap, keep it cool. Don't stare at the money, or it'll think you're a creep. Nah.